case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. The Supreme Court of New Mexico heard a 1993 case, Ruggles v. Ruggles, which centered on the fair division of property in a divorce, specifically focusing on retirement benefits. The court proposed a flexible approach to determining the value of benefits, taking into account factors such as employment termination and time remaining before retirement eligibility. The issue at hand was whether the non-employee spouse should receive monthly payments or an immediate lump sum. The case stemmed from two lower court rulings that followed the pay-as-it-comes-in rule, which stipulated that non-employee spouses were only entitled to payments once the employee spouse retired. The Supreme Court deemed this issue of substantial public interest and revised the rulings to ensure that property attributed to community earnings was divided equally between spouses upon dissolution of marriage. The court emphasized that immediate distribution of community interest was often preferable to avoid delay or unfairness. The Supreme Court determined that voluntary property settlements between divorcing spouses could not be changed by the court, except in specific circumstances. The court ultimately reversed the Court of Appeals' decisions and remanded each case to the district court for further proceedings in line with the revised ruling. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSD.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.